downtown. Those construction zones a little bit slow. And there is reports right now of a disabled vehicle in New Berlin, the Rock Freeway 43 northbound, and Layton disabled vehicles blocking the shoulder there. It is 801 right now, and it's been four months since Marquette alum and international journalist James Foley was captured in Syria. This is the second time he's been held captive overseas. And his family, as you can imagine, is growing more concerned by the day. Angelica Duria joins us now live on Marquette's campus, where they will hold a vigil later today. Good morning. Good morning to you guys, and today is actually the two-year anniversary of when James Foley was kidnapped the first time. That was in Libya. He was freed 45 days later, and now once again his parents are asking others to pray with them tonight for his safe return. James Foley graduated from Marquette University back in 1996. For the past year, he was working as a freelance journalist reporting on the ongoing war in Syria when he was captured by gunmen near the east side of of the country on Thanksgiving Day. His whereabouts are unknown at this time. Now, as we've mentioned, this is the second time Foley's been held in captivity. An international campaign worked towards his release in 2011. Now, once again, his family is pleading for his safe return. They held a similar vigil that they plan to hold tonight back in January. We're gravely concerned about Jimmy's health and welfare and safety. We miss him terribly. Uh, he's in our thoughts and our prayers every day. And we're committed to do everything within our ability to secure a safe release. And this is our only priority. The family has launched a website, freejamesfoley.org, with information on their son, who is now missing for 134 days. There is also a petition for his release, and Fox 6 will be meeting with his parents one on one later this morning. But as for that vigil tonight, that'll be held at 7 o'clock at the Chapel of the Holy Family inside the Alumni Memorial Union here at Marquette. Reporting live at Marquette University, Angelica Duria, Fox 6 News. Thanks, Angelica. Staff